Hello and welcome to Celebrity Trends. If it's your first time, please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell for more amazing news on your favorite celebrities. The aftermath of Prince Harry swerving his best friend's wedding still rumbles on with eyebrows raised at the runaway Duke ditching his longtime pal Jack Mann on the biggest day of his life. Mann was a groomsman at Harry's own wedding to Meghan in 2018 and featured in the famous Band of Brothers. Photo from Windsor Castle on the night of the Royal Knees Up According to the Mail on Sunday Royal, editor Rebecca English Friends of the Duke say they've been quote disgusted by what Harry's done since leaving the royal family. She added there are people who have said we've been very loyal to him over the years and we don't feel that loyalty has been repaid. Cara Kennedy is this proof that isolated Harry will be consigned to Montecito forevermore. Yes, I think that's definitely part of it, but so Jackman wasn't just a groomsman. It's been alluded to that he was actually Harry's real best man at his wedding. That's how close they were, and yeah, that's all destroyed now, and I think it is sad, and it does show that he must be isolated and have a feeling of great loneliness these boys were. Just a few years ago, Harry's life, his entire support network, and now it's all gone, but from what I can gather there was a key moment, with this friendship broke up, I have been in contact with one of the people that were there at this particular weekend which is apparently the weekend that everybody knew that they weren't going to have the same friendship with Harry and it was a weekend at Sandringham where quote Michael stacked the joy out of any remarkable joke with wolfery and chippiness. We all realized wars at that weekend so I think I think Meghan was definitely fundamental in the breakdown of that relationship. Well, yes, I'm in dot a controlling partner will try to separate you from your friends and family, do you think? Megan's guilty of that in relation to Harry? Seriously, I mean they didn't fit the mold, these were kind of Jack the Lads types very fun very boyish and they didn't fit the mold of what Megan wanted to be. She wanted to be a real life respectable princess so when she saw Harry running around with these lads, yeah I think it was in her best interest to get rid of them. Is he happy? Don't think so, I mean would you be happy isolated away from your entire family friends? He has no real support network there, I mean everything we've heard of since with him kind of getting these celebrity friends has been later proved to not be the case. There was one case with Orlando Bloom and Katy Perry, they kind of made out that they were a lot better friends than they were. I mean even look at the wedding with people like George Clooney and his wife invited and then they come out later and say we didn't even know them, we'd never even met them so is it. This is a case of kind of trying to keep up appearances, because they really don't have any friends. Yes, I mean Kara hand on heart briefly. If you can do you, think that secretly he wants to come home. I think he's in too deep now. I think he would want to come home. I think it would be very embarrassing for Megan to allow that to happen. I still do think that it would be the case that he would be welcomed back with open arms. But I think that is far too late for her, I don't think that she would be welcomed back by the British people or all by the family at all, but I think we've always a place for Harry, always Carrot Kennedy. Thanks for watching. Till next time on Celebrity Trends.